Here's my, um, well, that's rope fish right there. She's about two years old. Um, and here's my little precious dragon lady. She's a lesser siren. She's about, I think, about four years old or so. Um, let me see that cute. You can see her gills right here. She's a little shy. She's very friendly. She likes to eat shrimp pellets, and the bloodworms are her favorite. She lives actually in the community tank. I have two angelfish right here, my guys. I have two rope fish, and I have albino clawed frogs. There's two of them, and the other one is hiding over there. She's very She's very um, peaceful. She doesn't bother other fish. She, let's see how long she is. She's right here. And she goes all the way over there. There she goes. There's the end of the tail. So that's the whole tank. That is 75 gallons. Uh, the water temperature is... I don't have a heater, so it's what it is. I live in Florida, so it stays warm. Um, I do water changes about once a month or so. I change about 20 to 30 percent. Um, it's very easy. I just use my hose. So it, they, this whole thing does not require that much maintenance, really. Those shrimp pellets is mainly what I use. And then the blood worms. And uh, as a treat, I buy them earthworms and red worms. So you can actually buy it at the bait store which is pretty cool. Um, this is all fake plants. None of it is real because that would be just a little too much. Oh, I have the sucker fish over there too. I don't know if you can see him. Um, this is my favorite tank so far. I've been running this thing for like three years now. Um, and I absolutely love it. Here are some shrimp pellets and the dragon lady. She also goes by Lily. <laughs> You can see her eat. She's really, really cute. And she is such a nice animal. I mean, if you touch her, she feels very, very soft. She does not require much maintenance. And I don't even have mud. They naturally they live in muddy puddles and um Yeah. And they can even hibernate in um and mud and not eat for about up to a year but I have a sand it's not even deep enough for her to bury but she is I mean she's a happy little siren and she I mean obviously is an amphibian she comes from the salamander family and she's very easy I found her at a um, pet supermarket somebody brought her over